Hello VC, welcome to the Inner Sleeve. I'm your host DR. Tonight's video is one from the collection. And the record from my collection I'm sharing today is this one. Allison Chains Dirt. And this is the MOV pressing. So as a lot of you guys are aware, this album has definitely gone up in value over the last year. I bought it uh, at my local record store, it was only like $31. And now I look today on Discogs, and the cheapest one I can find uh, was $155 US dollars. And I see the medians up to like $123 right now. Uh, and people are asking for over $200. I think I even saw one at $250 or $280 or something like that. It's crazy. Uh, personally, I would never pay that for this. Uh, I'm glad I got it when I did so that I can have it in my collection. I don't plan on selling it, but because uh, I do enjoy the album. And uh, it's probably, like I said, one of my favorite, um, probably my favorite Alice in Chains album. Um, I like the first one and the third one as well. This is our second studio album. This was released in, on September 29th, 1992. So all four original members of the band, this was the last album they were together on. Uh, the bassist uh, was gone after this album. So as you guys know, uh, the four members of Alice in Chains, the original members that were on this album, are Lane Staley on vocals, Jerry Cantrell on guitars, and we have, we have Mike Starr on bass, and Sean Kinney on drums. So Mike Starr left or was booted out or whatever after this album. So this was the one of two albums that the original four were on, obviously the first one and this one. Uh, again, this is the MOV pressing, we'll take a look at it here. So this album went four times platinum. Uh, so you guys can hear, see here the front cover and the back. The hype sticker I still have, but I actually left it on the original plastic sleeve, which I saved in a different location, so I don't have easy access to it. But it does not have a, it's not a gatefold, it's just a standard jacket. And this is the inner sleeve, here at the inner sleeve. So we have the lyrics on this side, and then we just have the credits and everything on, on this side. It's a very heavy paper for the inner sleeve, glossy on the one side. Uh, songs on this are uh, Them Bones. I love that song. Damn That River, Rain When I Die, Down in a Hole, obviously everybody knows that song. Love that song too. Sick Man, Rooster, probably my favorite song on the album and one of my all-time favorite uh, Alice in Chains songs. And that's the end of side B, and then we have, or end of side A, and then we have Junkhead on B, as along, with, along with Dirt, Godsmack, Hate to Feel, Angry Chair, again another song that I love off of this album, and Wood. So. This is, uh, again, this is the MOV Pressing. The MOV Pressing came out in 2009. We'll go ahead and we'll take a, a look at the vinyl. It's on the Columbia red label here. This is my, I think this was my first MOV Pressing and I'm super happy with MOV. MOV, MOV does such a great job with their pressings, and ever since this album, I, I seek out MOV. Uh, one of my favorite albums are on, on that label, and uh, or if MOV has pressed them because they sound really good, and that's really the album that got me into that. Uh, like Alice in Chains, I grew up, you know, I was, in 1992, I was in college, so grunge era was kind of pivotal in my music um, development and what I liked at that time. Although, to be honest, I've gotten away from it now as I've gotten older and I've gotten back more into straight heavy metal and those type of things, but I still like Alice in Chains and enjoy uh, the, this album, Dirt. So I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. Keep the, those turntables spinning. See ya.